All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is another day we get to work on this wonderful little Tesla that we bought, the Model 3. Last time we got a lot of work done. We got the subframe knocked out. The suspension's pretty much done. We're still waiting for some wheels to come in, and then we can do the alignment on it. But today we get to paint. So I'm really excited. Right now, we got everything sanded down. We're in the paint booth. We're going to pretty much paint inside the door jam. We're going to probably put some color on this quarter panel so it'll be easier to blend a little bit later. Also, we got the door we're going to paint, and we're going to jam it inside and out. So right now, we're going to get straight to it. We're going to get this thing knocked out, and then we got a lot of sanding ahead of ourselves. So let's get straight to it. Continuing the painting, we got the rear bumper, we got the front bumper, and then we got the little pieces that we're gonna paint. The spoiler we'll paint later, because I'm still on the fence about putting it on. But pretty much what we're gonna do is we're gonna put bumper adhesion on this first, because it's raw plastic, and then we're gonna put sealer, and then we're gonna put black. So we're gonna paint the bottom trim black on the, this bumper. We're painting all this inside, all black. Then we're gonna tape it up, paint, start painting the red. You guys are gonna see the color I chose. It's gonna be a sweet color, it is red. So let's go ahead and mix up some Bulldog or some bumper adhesion and start getting paint.
right, so there we have it. Look at that color. Once I put a clear on it, it's gonna flow really good. So it's like a pearl red, and I really like it. So we got pretty much four coats of the base, five coats of the pearl, and before we put clear, we're gonna tape this up. We'll let this ray flash, and we're gonna paint the bottom black. And on the, this bumper too, we're gonna paint all the inside black, have like a two-tone thing. It's gonna make the red pop even more. And then for the rear, I guess whatever this thing is, we're gonna paint that black too. So let's go ahead and tape it up. Put about two coats of black base on it, untape it, clear it, and we'll be done.
All right guys, it's the next morning and this paint looks good. I can kind of touch it. We're gonna still let it cure and see other things. But I'm loving this color. If you guys haven't guessed, it's almost the same color as my truck that it is. So it's, it's gonna be almost, almost identical, except the bases are a little different, but the color on it is looking good. I can't wait to pull it in the sunlight and see what it looks like. And also last night, I found some wheels for this thing finally. So I went over there and I got them picked up and I got me some 20 inch wheels, some bronze. So I think this is gonna make it look really good. So these are 18s, these are 20. They're gonna be looking really good. And I was so excited last night, I actually put them on. So let's go on that side and check them out how they are. Let's check that out. It still needs alignment, but uh, it's looking pretty good. It's almost flush with it. It's almost flush over there, but it looks like we're gonna have to lower this thing a little bit. It's sitting a little high, but I think I had those on order. But unfortunately, that's all the time we got for this episode, you guys. Leave us a comment down below what you guys think of the color. I'm loving it, and we'll catch you guys next time.